Hi, I'm Alvaro Saad Rios, and I'm a playwright. I've uh, been writing for 15 plus years. Your voice is most important. Tell that story that you want to tell. Don't worry about how it's going to be produced. Don't worry about anything else. Just tell your story. Tell the one that you really feel like needs to be told that isn't being told. Consider adding comedy, even if it's a very serious subject. I mean, if you really think about it, there are some uh, tough subjects out there that can be easier for us to have that discussion if we implement a little bit of comedy in there. And, and I know that's hard, but think about that in a way that if you can get somebody to laugh, maybe you might get them to actually listen too. Don't be afraid to make mistakes. Each time I write a play, I always want it to be perfect the first time and it never is. I mean, even my second draft and third draft, these are things that I don't want to share with anyone. But the great thing is that once you write it down, you get a little closer to where you're trying to, to get in terms of the story that you're telling. It's also a, a piece of advice that I have to keep reminding myself is don't be afraid to make mistakes. What I love about playwriting is that we can be able to shed light on stories that aren't um, traditionally told in American theater or that stories that we aren't even aware of now. That's what I love about theater is that we can be able to create these pieces that start shining the light on things that happen in a specific community, um, your own community, in places that we didn't even know existed. And what's great also is that unlike film and TV, that it's not stagnant in the sense that once it's, if you think about it in terms of film and TV, once they film it, they're done. And theater can continue to change based on what is happening today and what continues to happen. You can continue to develop a piece that really celebrates a voice of a community that nobody's aware of. By telling these stories, the ones that people aren't aware of, I think we can make other communities aware that we're all, we're kind of similar. Hopefully that'll build some empathy for people to understand that we all kind of want the same thing. Theater needs your voice. Only you can write those stories about what is actually happening and going on. I mean, the last thing you want is some old guy like me telling that story. You know that story better than I do. And so tell that story, participate in Hashtag Enough. Let us know how you're feeling in terms of what's going on. Only you can be able to tell your story and, and how you're, what you're experiencing in your community, at your school, and that's a voice that we need to hear. We here in this country need to hear more from young voices because your voice is as important as any other writer that you read in school. Write what you want to write, whatever it is, no matter how magical or how strange or crazy or funny or sad, write what you want to write because ultimately that is your voice and that is most important. Thank you very much for listening. Send your plays by June 20th to enoughplays.com. We look forward to hearing what you have to say.